One of my greatest summer pleasures is spending a morning at the Green City Market, a farmer's market in Lincoln Park dedicated to local and sustainable meat and produce. It is unlike most urban farmer's markets occupying city streets or parking lots in that the grassy setting invites leisure and a village green vibe. I find it inspirational to check out the seasonal offerings, select something that pleases my eye, then go home and find a new recipe or method to prepare it. The colors at the market are delightful, from the wide spectrum of tonal greens to the bright reds and pinks of tomatoes, rhubarb, and berries. Even the earthy mushrooms, beets, and eggs contribute to the rich palette of various hues. The atmosphere at the market is festive yet relaxed, a unique melding of community, culture, and food. Local chefs host demonstrations using whatever is available that week. The market provides a wonderful outing for babies and toddlers with parents in tow and provides educational opportunities for daycare and school-aged children. On this particular day, children sampled a variety of greens through the auspices of Club Sprouts, dedicated to educating children about planting, harvesting, and eating foods that are good for the body and the planet. The farmers and vendors who make up the market are all committed to sustainable farming practices and increasing the availability of heirloom and heritage meats, fruits, and vegetables. I enjoy discovering where the different farmers and vendors are from, mostly small towns from Illinois, Michigan, and Indiana. No matter where they come from, the farmers bring a hometown warmth and hospitality to the urban setting. The vendors' names provide a bit of poetic pleasure. There are the alliterative names, Hawks Hill Elk Ranch, Pasta Putana, Grass is Greener Gardens, and Prairie Pure Cheese, as well as the merely evocative, Tiny Greens, Florial Bakery, Tomato Mountain, and Bushland Pex. And if the market were not sensually gratifying enough, try sampling the variety of fares that are prepared fresh using market ingredients, husk wrapped tamales, fruit, cheese, and vegetable stuffed crepes, fried cheese, or buttery tarts. I prefer visiting the market on Wednesday mornings early before the sun is too directly overhead and the produce and offerings are at their freshest and most ample. The children are participating and the dogs are welcome. The Saturday market is a bit more hectic and crowded, but either reminds me of the celebratory feel of a Chicago summer day.